What is happening, my home skillets? I'm here chilling with my main man, Mac. Say hi to the camera, Mac. He was wagging his tail. Mac. Mac. There it goes. There it goes. So you got to make the people believe I'm treating you right, Mac. Ain't that right? Ain't that right, Mac? Mm. Then why are you trying to be camera shy? You just gave me a kiss. You you think that's gay, hmm? It's not gay. I'll give you a kiss. Come on. Mm. There you go. Ah, there goes Gabby. But, um... This vlog isn't going to be as long as my usual ones because I have a meeting with the people at the apartment that I'm supposed to be getting and stuff and stuff. And today, I just want to chill out. I've recorded a lot of shit. I've edited, I've edited a lot of stuff. It's just been a long day and I just want to sit down and kill people via Call of Duty. So, um, yeah. So... I plan on chilling out for the rest of the day after this. This is going to be my last video, maybe. I could be lying. But, right now, my Tokyo Ghoul uh, Route A Episode 2 review is up. So, if you're into Tokyo Ghoul, check it out. Yeah. But, um, I have a very, very important question. Now, um, I'm not like a lot of channels that just basically blatant, blatantly ask you guys for money. But, I recently set up this support button on my actual YouTube channel. It may appear under my videos uh, uh, above the comment box. I'm not sure, but actually on my channel, there's a support button that you can press to donate me like a million dollars if you're rich or whatever. But, you know, I'm not asking you guys for money. I would never do that. But as soon as I set it up, someone noticed it and gave me like three bucks. And I'm like, okay, that's awesome. You know, I appreciate every little bit, but I don't want... To receive any money when I haven't really done anything. So, just for people that do want to send JB Dutch Sheeha or JB Daily, I'm sorry, I keep getting this shit confused. If there's anything you want to send, just give me a list of like things that you will want me to do in return. Like, I could put you in the credits of my next video or. I can even put you in a video via Skype or something. I mean, I just don't want to receive money, and I'm not doing anything to deserve it, you know? And I'm talking with the person that just uh, donated out of nowhere. I mean, I just set it up like 30 minutes later. Somebody already donated. I'm like, whoa, whoa. I got to do something for you guys, so tell me what you guys think. Like, maybe $1 get mentioned in credits in the video, like $10. You actually get to be in a video. You know, stuff like that. Just give me a, a list of what you guys think would be appropriate. Because if you guys are going to donate to me, for whatever reason, for whatever reason, I want you guys to feel rewarded. And, you know, yeah, I'm not like other YouTubers that just take your money and don't give a damn and just continue making videos without giving back. So, tell me what you guys think about that. And, um, fuck. It's fucking raining outside. I was going to go outside and run and walk and do my daily thing but it's wet as shit i'm sorry i just had a facetime call and i'm on my ipad so it fucked up everything so i gotta splice these two videos together now but anyway how's it going guys how was your day dudes how's it hanging females how's your tits doing i mean are they nice and plump i mean are they doing okay do you need me to check on them for you because i will i, I promise i will but speaking of tits and boobs I believe someone on my JB Dutch page when I said I was going to do my Q&A video that still isn't out yet for some reason. Um, they asked me what my dream woman was and since I talk about boobs a lot, um, they d decided to ask me what else do I like in a woman besides boobs. Now let me tell you, nothing in this world is more important besides boobs. I'm just kidding. But no, my dream woman, I mean, someone that... I can watch anime with, laugh with. I mean, your boobs don't even have to be big. I mean, I like I like behind too. I like the badonkis. I like the donkey. I like I like that stuff. So, tits and ass, you know, it's a man thing. But personality and and you know, looks. You don't even have to look like a model. You don't even have to look like fucking Beyonce or anything like that, Nicki Minaj or anything. I, I can't even believe I said Nicki Minaj. I don't even find her too attractive because I don't find fake asses attractive. But anyway, got off track. My dream woman is just someone that I can laugh with, watch anime with, and I mean, you can't be like butt ugly to the point when I wake up next to you 
I have nightmares when I'm awoke or awake, whatever the fuck. But yeah, I, I really don't ask for much out of a female. I mean, the boobs, if you if you got big tits, girl, you, I mean, you're all right. You're all right by me. But like I said, it's not really all about that. I kind of put on a front to make you guys laugh. But I mean, I do like boobs. What guy doesn't? I mean, I'm pretty sure some of you girls like boobs yourself. If you got big boobs, you probably love yourself. I mean, if I was a female, if JB the Chiha or fuck, if JB, if JB was a female, I promise that's all I do all day is just just fondle myself and just juggle them around, clap them together, and just just put stuff in between them. You females don't understand how many pockets, how many natural pockets you have. You have don't you have that you know if you're blessed enough with you know space right there, and you have a moist one. You have every female has a moist pocket unless you know i mean i guess some could have a dry pocket that'll be really really uncomfortable probably to you but i mean males don't have pockets we have well we don't have anything really i mean i guess you could say if you're if you roll that way a guy can have a pocket but i don't have any pockets the only pockets i have is in these tight ass shorts i don't know why i have these tight ass shorts on I'm not sure what's going on with my life today. Sorry, sorry, I got FaceTimed again. I really should put on airplane mode while I'm recording. I think I'll do that next time. So now it's three videos that have to splice together. But, as you guys know, well, you don't know, but I'm about to tell you, my birthday's in two days. Today's the 15th, my birthday's on the 17th. I will be 23 years old. So if any females want to show me tips for my birthday, you're more than welcome to. If any guys, if you want to show me a female that would show me tits you're more than welcome to if you guys i mean i mean just just tits i i want to have a, a a bountiful a bountiful boob birthday that's going to be the theme the the cake is going to be giant boobs uh the the fucking i'm not sure where i'm going to have it at might as well have it in the strip club i mean more, what better place to see boobs at but another interesting tidbit about jb did you know that I have a dragon? Some people know, some people don't, but I have a real life dragon. He is awesome. His name is Bartholomew. I ride him to work every day. And um I can't show him to you right now because he's he's gone. He's gone to uh Dragon Land doing dragon things, probably at the, the dragon grocery store. They always have to rebuild it because it keeps getting burned down, but yeah, I'll introduce you guys to Bartholomew one day, maybe if he ever decides to show up while I'm vlogging. He he always seems to go away whenever I have a camera in front of me. I don't know why. I mean, he he doesn't like people to know that he exists, I guess, because dragons are such a rarity these days. But yes, Bartholomew is he's real. He's real, guys. You gotta just take my word for it. And I know I walked past this and someone asked me about this. This right here is a portrait that my cousin did of me and my mommy when I was a young sexy JB and yeah I think I had, I had an afro then yeah that was years and years and years and years ago actually like probably like three years ago but yeah I'll get you guys to meet mama JB whenever she's around she's never she's never around she's never she's never here unless uh unless there's food <laughs> But anyway, this has been a, such a long day. I'm tired. I'm sleepy. I don't know if you guys can tell. But yeah, make sure you guys tell me what you think I should do about the support button thing. Like, how much should I do for whatever? Like, I want, like, different tiers. Because, like I said, I don't want to ask. You know, I'm not going to ask anyone for money ever. But if you do give me money, I want to feel like I'm giving you something back. So tell me what you guys think I should do with that stuff but I cannot wait tomorrow is Friday which technically starts the weekend so I can show you guys to some fun places some parks some malls and some stuff like that and maybe show you some of my real life personal friends maybe even Subaki swag because she just stays like right up the street but if you're a guy wrap it up if you're a female shake your boobs and have a good night